What's up guys, Joe Beer here from Moe Beer for our second edition of Backyard Beers. Uh, I hope you really enjoyed the first one. Uh, I'm out back here in my backyard sitting in my shitty plastic Adirondack chair because, you know, I'm too cheap to spring for the $300 chairs. Why get a $300 chair? If it breaks, you gotta spend $300 more. This one breaks, $17.99, Lowe's Home Improvement, looks real, doesn't feel real, flimsy as hell, will break at, at, at the drop of a dime. So. Uh, here I am, beautiful New Hampshire day. It's like 67 degrees out, but after winter in New Hampshire, it might as well be 80 degrees out. I'd take my shirt off, get a tan uh, back here in the woods of New Hampshire. So uh, today, we're gonna review Pipe Dream Brewing, uh, Erie IPA, I believe it's Erie. It says Erie, could be Irie. I don't really know how to read Jamaican that well. Um, I'm assuming it's a Jamaican language because it's got Jamaican colors. Um, so we're gonna... We're gonna review this. So here's my problem with Pipe Dream Brewing. Uh, your labels suck. Everything looks the same. It's all Jamaican colored palm trees. Don't get me wrong. I love summer, I love palm trees, love vacation, vacation forever. Uh, I, I love the, the vibe it's going on, but I don't know what fucking beer is what. If it's mango, if it's this, if it's that, it all looks Jamaican. I think it's all infused with marijuana, which would be totally fine as long as, uh, you know, we were staying at home, not doing anything, had lots of potato chips to eat in the house. It would be totally cool, so. We're gonna do uh, Pipe Dream Brewing. Your label suck. Looks like my daughter made it on Adobe Photoshop for Junior, then stuck it on a can. Uh, this is a double India. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, double India Pale Ale that is triple dry hopped. Not once, not twice, but three times dry hopped uh, with Simcoe, Mosaic, and Amarillo hops, along with 400 fucking pounds of fresh pineapples imparting a floral aroma and a juicy tropical citrus flavor. The more I do, the heavier my Boston accent gets, even though I really don't have one. Um, 400 pounds of fucking pineapples. How do you fit 400 pounds of pineapples in this can? This big, not possible. I think you're lying, Pipe Dream. I think you're lying, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Here we go. I'm gonna pop the top. Mm. I'm gonna pour it in my tulip glass. Still doesn't say Mobia, whatever. He's gonna drop some off at my work. Uh, hopefully sometime this week so I can get some, uh, you know, some advertising going on. My God, this thing is pouring. This thing pours like a pulpy orange juice. Look at that, hold up to the sun. Look at, can you see it? Let me block the sun here. Here we go, look at this. Can't even see through it. It's not hazy, it's fucking foggy. It's, it's, it's the fog, it's Stephen King's The Fog in a glass. Can't even see through it. Can you see my face? Don't think so, it's dense. Oh my God, it smells like 400 fucking pounds of pineapples. Oh my God. Oh, it smells like the produce section at Shaw's. Oh, let's give it a go, ready? Here we, here we go. Mmm, my God, my God, they weren't lying when they said 400 pounds of pineapples. That's a lot of fucking pineapple. Oh, it's 8%. You can taste the liquor. It tastes like a core of a pineapples in there. I think they went a little too heavy on the pineapple. I'm going to give it a 3 out of 10. Not very crushable, not a good backyard beer. Oh my God, it tastes like the label. The label matches the taste. It tastes like shit. It tastes like shit. I'm gonna drink it because it's 8%. It was 17 bucks for four cans. I'll pound them down. But uh, probably be the last time I have any kind of pipe dream in the future. I like that mango IPA. I had it once on tap. It was crisp, refreshing, great crushable beer. I thought, looking at this can, it looked like summertime. It doesn't taste like summertime. It tastes like, it tastes like fermenting, fermented pineapples. Oh my God, it's bitter. It's gross. Not into it. Don't crush it. Don't drink it. Don't bring it in your backyard. Leave it in the store. Get something else, all right?